Okay, let's try this again. So to yesterday, I tried to do my pop feel, sop feel reveal. Um, however, my laptop decided not to record it all and record one second. Um, as you can see, we are joined by Pina. Jetta is in the naughty corner because he bit me. And you'll be able to hear him in the background. So let's start off with what came in my sop feel, pop feel bag in the mail. Um, I tried some items on today and I will say quite nice. Not all the products um, seem to be as nice as some of the stuff that came in. However, some of it's pretty good. Um, some of the packaging could use a little bit of work. Um, like, you'll, I'll show you most of the stuff is in just a plain black box. Um, doesn't really have the prescription on it. Um, some people might need a little more information. I know I like my stuff with information on it. Um, but to begin with, first one I opened was the Instant Lift Eyebrow Pencil. Oh. <laughs> Poop off the side. <laughs> okay, come here. There, you poop and then you can come back. <laughs> the joys of having a bird, too. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Just a pencil. Um, it does come with the spoolie end. And then it comes with the actual product. So it's just, I don't know how to show you this. I don't, I'm new to this. I need more to come in today. So it does come with, you know, the brown part. I'm not going to try it just yet because I am not a... Oh, that still landed on me. All right, you can come back now. Yeah. Let's be thankful that we have paper in here. Hey, we cleaned that right up. Thank God that didn't land in my hair. So it did come with four, four brushes. So we've got this brush, which I assume, I'm not a brush person. I just assume it's like a, a, a maybe a foundation brush. Um, because it did come with a foundation. Um, I'm assuming an eyeshadow brush. This may be the foundation brush as well. I mean, I know I've got some... Oh, Jesus. <coughs> Stuff came off that and I haven't even used it. Um, I did use this, however, the other day. Um, I used it in the lip gloss. I thought they were lipsticks, but they're actually lip glosses. So I use that. Pretty good. All right. So the next is a North Show. So this doesn't actually even have pop fill written on it. Um, it is a waterproof durable mascara. So that's that one there. I'd appreciate it if you didn't wreck those, Bubba. So, it comes with the mascara. Now, it came with three, not one, not two, but three different types of concealers. I did try them. So this is the high definition concealer. Does that work? I don't know, but if it does, fantastic. <laughs> um, it was okay. I mean, for me, it came across as okay. I was really happy with the stick concealer. The pop feel, wait a second, there it is. The pop feel concealer stick. It was really nice to put on. Nice and creamy. Spread it out very nicely. It was very nice. I attempted, oh, I'll show you the labelling, pop feel, doo -doo -doo, full coverage concealer. It is a nice cream. Um, again, just stuck my finger in it, tried it on. I guess it kind of worked. Um, didn't really try it. <laughs> Next part, 
I don't know if you actually get to pick what um, <laughs> color foundation or any colors that you get in this pack because it must come pre-packed <laughs> and so my foundation that I got was this color pop feel thank you very much for that but I am NOT that tanned <laughs> as you can see I'm quite pale yes mummy pale yeah so mm, that was great um oh another brow product pop feel eyebrow waterproof eyebrow set this probably not a product I'll use um, at the moment just to do my eyebrows I use a color from my James Charles palette and just use one of those angled small brushes um, whereas this is a, a spoolie <laughs> I tried this yesterday and not nice <laughs> just wasn't nice it made my eyebrows feel all uh, stiff and then when you tried to move them, it was like they were all crusty. I'm not a fan. Um, so, I don't know exactly what this is. Is it like, this is what I mean. It doesn't exactly say, oh, that light's in the way. It doesn't exactly say what you use it for. I mean, I know it says photo finish and it's got the smooth and blur written on it. So, am I to assume it's a... A primer of some sort that you use um, oh never mind it clearly says primer down the bottom I did not read that before um, however when I tested it on my hand it didn't, didn't feel right it um, was a bit slimy um, I mean maybe I just didn't use it right hey that could happen I'm new to the priming business because um, at the moment oh actually I used the foundation skin base pop feel today da, da, da. I used that one today and I am rather happy I mean I know that's probably bad lighting and you can't tell hi Pina hello we're all blurry most likely and refocus there we go um, so I used that today and quite happy with how it was because um, most of the primers that I've been trying out at the moment I've got one that's almost a foundation color um, didn't really like it I've got a I think it's a clear one it's not too bad uh, however I used this one from Potfield today it's white and it's got little dots in it um, love it it did a really good job today especially with my forehead lines very nice they didn't show up my I normally get um, like the little smile creases don't have those so very nice to buy very nice I was happy um, however again it could have a little more instructions because even on the box it didn't really have anything on it <laughs> I'm assuming this is a lip balm again completely clear white has nothing written on it whatsoever <laughs> so <laughs> we're just going to assume it's a lip balm my favorite bits that came you get three matte lip creams and um pop filled lips <laughs> it doesn't really say it. i'm just assuming they're lipsticks um but this is the one I'm wearing today. Go away, camera. Pop feel lip cream. Very nice to put on. Lasted all day. And I love my nudie colors. Um, it did does. I got a bright red one. Super bright red. And then I got a a dark dark red, maroon kind of red. Now these. All it says is pop feel lips. Probably can't see that. But anyway. Lipstick. Such gorgeous colours. Again, I got a bright red. I mean that looks orange, but it's bright red. 
And then I also got a nude. So whether or not they match the colours, because this is a nude. So it could quite possibly be the same colour as what I'm wearing. You would think I'd try that, but I didn't. And I'm not. And then another red. You like a red? Do you like the red? No? Okay. I don't like it. Alright. Now come the plain black boxes, like literally, just a black box. This one, they are a bit tricky to open. Ah, so this is the lip gloss palette. I used the black one yesterday just to try and see what it was like. Again, not mad. Like, I, I tried on one of the bright red ones and loved the colour. And I used the black one just to do a centre line. You could see it, so it was nice. Again, black palette. So the thing is, two of these are the same size and then two are the larger sizes. Contour palette, press, press powder. I'm not much of a contour. If I want to contour, I use my bronzer, which is who knows how old it is. It's from BYS from many years ago. I know you're supposed to throw your stuff out, but I don't. And I know that's bad. I'm working on it. Uh, so next is the, um, the eyeshadow palette that comes in there. I'm not much of a nude color person. I'm more into the colors just to show off a little bit more. But this, again, plain black box, this is the colours that came in it. They're just all nude colours, really. There's like one pink one. Um, Pigment-wise, not really there. Um, yeah, yeah. Mm, you'd be better off not getting one of the eye palettes or not one of those ones. They do have other ones which probably would be better. Um, last but not least, again, pure black box. Um, I believe it would be another contouring palette and slash correctional palette as it's all creams and, you know, you've got your colour corrections on this side. Um, I don't dabble too much in the colour correction. I don't really need it. Um, but that is all the stuff that came in my pop feel, soft feel um, collection. Um, oh, and it came with a sponge, which isn't really the best. Um, it's a very hard sponge, so uh, I might stick to the sponges I use at the moment. But yeah, so I had all this organised yesterday. Uh, my laptop decided not to film the whole thing, but decided to film one second. So this was just me running through my pop feel, sop feel package. <laughs> say bye bye. You say bye bye, Pinna. Bye guys!